The Power BI team just released the possibility to export flat tables from Power BI service instead of pivot tables into Excel. And I'm going to show you how that is done. Okay, so I have here this report in Power BI service. The normal experience is you would go to export, analyze in Excel, and this thing is going to create a pivot table. So here you have it. And this is good if you're just exploring the data, but sometimes you want the raw data to do something else, to put it with your own table, so whatever it is, and this doesn't cut it, right? So now they are starting to roll out. I don't know if they're planning anything else, but this is what you are able to do anyhow. You can select a visual that has your data, a vision, not the entire report. So you're not able to get the entire report and get into tables, unfortunately. So you go in here, export data, and then it says 150 rows if it's Excel, 30,000 rows if it's CSV, that's weird. So you export it, you open it, and here you have the table now. If you click Enable Editing, this table is supposed to be live connected. They are rolling it out and it's not live connected for me. So if you go to Data and Query Connections, you can see that it's not live. But it will be, it's just rolling out. So it means that when the source updates, this will update too. And then you can do anything that you like. You can even see the um, DAX behind. Once you have the connection thing here, you right click and click, I think the connection details, connection properties, and you will be able to see it. I can't show you because I don't have it. Now, what do you need to be able to do this? First, you need to enable XMLA endpoints and analyzing Excel on the on-prem data set. You need to have either build permissions for the data set or contribute for the report, which is not great. I think it would be better just with view. You need to have a Power BI license, obviously, free work too. And this works both for uh, Excel in the web and in the desktop. So we'll see you hopefully on Friday with the offset function. Otherwise, we will do it next week. Let's see how much time I have. See you soon. Bye.